Hi guys and welcome along to another video of hidden places in Dublin and lots of other places. Why fires church in Dublin? What people may not know, it's actually the resting place of St. Valentine's. We all celebrate St. Valentine's Day, or a lot of people do. But little did you know that the priest, um, Father John Spratt, asked uh, Pope Gregory in 1935 for the remains of St. Valentine's and brought them back here to Ireland where they rest St. Whitefire's Church. Let's try to go in and have a look. It's been a tradition for some time now for couples to flock to the shrine to light a candle and declare their love for each other. So this is where the remains are of um, St. Valentine's. I went St. Spra. Sorry, Father Sprout went and asked uh, Pope George for the part, the, the remains, he was giving some of the remains in a file, but so there's only a portion of them here, there may be a portion of them somewhere else, but for all these remains that came here in the box. Back after Father Sprout died, the interest in the relics kind of died away, and it wasn't until the 1950s that they were taken back out of storage and given a permanent home here in the church. seen before, holy water on tap. So, if you're ever in Dublin and someone tells you that St. Valentine's is here in Dublin, they're not lying to you. It's here in Wirefire Street Church and the, the, the relics are in the box. Um, it's only part of these remains and a pile of blood. Um, yeah, St. Valentine's, here in Dublin. So there you go, St. Valentine's in Dublin. Just one of Dublin's many hidden gems or lesser known places. I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks very much for watching. Take care.